Hello, my name is Findimus. In this video, we are going to be learning about adding borders around your elements, basic CSS. If you want to follow along, link is in the description down below. Let's begin. CSS borders have properties like style, color, and width. For example, if we wanted to create a red 5 pixel border around an HTML element, we could use this class. Dot thin dash red border and then inside the curly brackets you're going to put border dash color colon red semicolon border dash width colon five picks semicolon border dash style colon solid semicolon inside style brackets create a class called thick green border this class should add a 10 pixel solid green border around an HTML element apply the class to your cat photo remember that you can apply multiple classes to an element using its class attribute by separating each class name with a space, for example, down below you see image, and then you have class equals, and then inside the quotes, class one, and then space, class two. So what they're saying is you only have to write the class word one time, and then if you have multiple classes, a simple space will suffice for separating them by the text editor, the reader, the compiler, whatever you're using. So let's take these objectives one by one and let's get them completed. Your image element should have the class smaller image. Okay, so let's go to the image element. It's here and we already have a class equals smaller image. This is already completed. Thank you very much. Your image element should have the class thick green border we don't have that yet so what we will do here is we will put a space remember the spelling matters here and I believe uh, if it's capital or not also matters so keep it all lowercase and we're gonna do thick dash green dash border okay and that's enough to separate the two classes, but keep them on the same element here, which is the image of the cat up here on the right. And that's the one we're editing. Your image should have a border width of 10 pixels. So we're gonna go back up to the style tags and where we're declaring stuff, we're gonna go, I don't like that they did this, it bugs me. So they have the P and the H too, and then they have a declaration here and a declaration. Ah, why? I would like to keep all the declarations together, but whatever. We'll go underneath smaller image, and we're going to declare dot, and we're going to do thick dash green dash border. And that's my cat calling me in the background. It'll be just a minute. Okay. So we're gonna do curly braces, hit enter, because we're almost done with this. I'll go, I'll go hang out. Okay, so we're gonna do border dash color colon space. We're gonna do green and then semicolon, enter border dash width colon space. And instead of five pixels, we're gonna do ten picks semicolon. And then the last one, we're gonna do border dash style, uh, colon there. And then we're gonna do solid, I believe, cause it's the same as the other one, solid. And semicolon after the word there. So now you'll see, since we've um, declared this class of thick green border and it's completed, it's just basically updating as we input the um, attributes specifics. And as I said, if you put red, it should update to red. If you um, if you put you know yellow, that'll change, just whatever. But to pass this objective, we need it to be green. And then pixels, here's another example. Instead of 10, if you put 100, 
you'll see there you go we're gonna take that back down though and the border around your image element should be green check solid 10 picks I mean these are just getting too easy am I right guys taking this course you're just starting to get into the groove you're starting to feel it really like how they focus on these so now that we have all these objectives complete we're gonna run the test we're feeling confident about the results here and we passed with flying colors I'll have to tell you that uh, I'm really proud of you guys and we're 23 percent of the way done with the basic CSS section for this certification program it's gonna be fun we'll get it done hit the submit button and uh, I'll see you guys on the next one uh, I look forward to seeing you guys after each one of these videos so now we'll do the outro mainly I look forward to just graduating with a certificate at the end how about that that's what I look forward to alright I know that you guys are here to get it done okay enough enough of the banter let's do the outro thank you for watching if you feel this video was helpful or you liked it hit the like button and if you want to see more content like this subscribe if you have any questions post them down in the comments below I do pretty good at answering those and I am Findimus and I will see you later and I hope everyone has a great day thank you